My client has nothing to do with the missing technology. He's a law-abiding citizen. He has nothing to hide. That's right. Mr. Hogan, is there something wrong? Happy. Stop sweating. How do you do that? Yeah, I feel kind of bad using Happy's belief like this. Mm, he'll get over it. Hey! Move out of the way! Hey, move out! Oh, 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 Stop oh, that guy! Oh, my God! This anymore. He's a thief. You're a child. Show some respect. He's not a child. He's 14 years old. No, I'm not. 14. I had a job when I was 14. My son is 14. He's a moron. Because I'm not 14. He's 14, even 15. He's not equipped to make these kinds of decisions. But ma'am, I'm it's not. It's true. Full. Teenagers' brains aren't fully developed yet. But he can't even rent a car. He doesn't need a car. He's meant to space. Thank you. How do you know these two people are working together? How do you know they're not in cahoots? Me and this cahoots? guy? Yeah. I don't yeah. know this guy. We don't know what's in that bag. Cahoots? We've been in cahoots the whole time. Murderer! <laughs> I'm now joined by Supervisor Walter Burke, who was at the scene of tonight's disturbance. Mr. Burke, you're saying you saw Spider-Man, with your own eyes, destroying multiple power lines? Uh, yes, yes sir, he did. There you have it, folks. First hand, from an unimpeachable witness, the Teen Terror attacking our electrical grid. Uh, yeah, he was, uh, yeah, he was talking to the Dirt Man. Beg your pardon? Yeah, uh, he was, he was talking to the Dirt Man before, uh, they worked together to make the power monster disappear with what appeared to be a sparkle web. Uh-huh. Uh, yep, thank you very much. Well, that's, uh, <clears throat> we'll have to, uh, circle back and confirm this, folks, and I'll talk to my producers, see if we can find out what's in Mr. Burke's thermos. But the fact remains, Spider-Man is a menace. We'll be right back after a brief word from Daily Bugle Supplements, the only other daily fix you need. And we're up. What? I got eyes on him. He's with his aunt, some guy I don't know. You sure? They're just leaving the shelter. Okay, don't lose him. Don't forget to schedule your graduation photo pickup. Cafeteria safety is no joke. Respect the signs or pay the consequences. This has been a message from the Cafeteria Safety Council. And now, Betty's Corner with Betty Brandt. It seems like only yesterday that we were just starting the adventure that we call high school. And what an adventure it's been. We learned new things, we traveled the world, we fell in love. We almost died multiple times. We made friendships that will last forever. Also, some of us disappeared for five years and then reappeared, but the less we talk about that, the better. What's important is that we made it. And as we look out onto an exciting and uncertain future, just remember the memories we've made here at Midtown High are the ones that we will cherish forever. That's Midtown News for today, and for one last time, this has been Betty Brandt, signing off. Happy graduation! Go Tigers! Woo!